ThyssenKrupp's steel business is a double disaster. Besides losing nearly a billion euros last year, it accounts for nearly 3% of Germany's CO2 emissions. Tackling that will test Berlin's green resolve. First, ThyssenKrupp would need to refit its blast furnaces. These use coal to turn iron ore into iron and unfortunately CO2. Replacements would be electric arc furnaces that use hydrogen to do the chemical heavy lifting. The only byproduct is water. But that switch could cost more than 7 billion euros. And then there's the problem of power. To be truly green, the hydrogen has to come from water split via electrolysis and with electricity coming from renewable sources. And it's a lot of electricity. Based on McKinsey estimates, in one year, ThyssenKrupp would consume more than a quarter of Britain's entire wind energy output. But that doesn't mean it's impossible. Germany has to do something about its CO2 emissions, and Berlin is already throwing 9 billion euros at hydrogen research. As technology improves and carbon taxes make traditional steel more expensive, even old timers like ThyssenKrupp could recover some shine.